So today I will be showing you a comic book effect. This is uh, the final image of the effect. Um, for this you can pick any random photo. I just picked the photo that was in my files. So the first thing you're going to do is copy your layer twice. So you can either drag it down to this folder down here or you can click, right click, and click duplicate layer and then press OK. So we're going to turn off the top layer real quick and go to the second layer and go to filter and then filter gallery. Go to artistic cutout and leave your number levels at 8, your edge simplicity at 0, and edge fidelity at 3. And then press OK. Next, we're going to go to that top layer that we turned off and turn it back on and press shift Control u Now you'll see that your layer has turned black and white. Next, we're going to go to Channels and press Control on the R and RGB layer. And now you'll see that some of your picture has been selected. Go back to the layers and uh, press shift control i to inverse your layer now click to make a new layer and then on that blank layer you're going to um, turn turn everything black and now you'll see that on your picture everything has been darkened so then you press uh, control d to deselect everything so now we're going to turn off the first two layers and go back to the layer where we had um, the artistic cutout. So now we're going to duplicate that layer and simply change the blending mode to soft light. Now you'll see that your picture has become a little bit brighter. That's a good thing. So now we're going to go to the layer where um, we desaturated everything and go to the filter gallery, go back to artistic and go to poster edges. Uh, when you when you do poster edges you should leave everything at one and then press OK. Um, and then we're going to change the blending mode to multiply and you'll see that everything has been darkened. So we're going to ch uh, change the levels to um, about 150 to lighten everything up. The last thing we are going to do is turn on our last layer and hold control and click on that layer and you should see again that things on your picture have been selected. So we're going to add a layer mask and you should see like an, uh, a negative of, this, of the layer that you just did. So now we're going to go to filter, pixelate, and color halftone. And we're going to leave the radius at 5. So you should see dots on this layer and what not. Then we're going to go to the blending change one more time and change it to overlay. And that's it. This is your comic book effect.